what is up you guys welcome back to my channel oh my god i'm excited you guys i okay i got some new stuff that i've never tried before and we're gonna give grace and then we're gonna get a thumbnail and then we're gonna get it in heavenly father in the name of jesus i'd like to thank you for the food that i'm about to receive i pray that it be of good nourishment to my body in jesus name i pray amen okay so yesterday i went out to the my local asian market and put these pastries here too and i went out and bought me some black bean noodles i've never tried these so these here are on this side these actually have like chunks of black beans that's what it looks like to me these are different from the ones that i tried last time on my channel um oh this thing's not even on and then these here are the spicy hot chicken flavor ramen korean black bean with korean black bean sauce these are on this side here and i think they're gonna be spicy because they came in the red pack like the spicy noodles comes in so i'm a little scared um okay we got that sizzling here i don't want it to be on the whole time because i don't want it to dry out and i just wanted my bread to be warm so i'm gonna turn it off for now so here we have a pastry there i bought four different types of pastries yesterday i'm not sure if they're korean um japanese i'm not quite sure the origin of where these pastries like where they come from so excuse my ignorance i'm sorry um but this one is a jalapeno hot dog bread and this one is a hot dog with cheese bun <laughs> basically so let's do a little thumbnail here. Oh my, how can I do this? Okay, I don't know. I kind of want, okay, let's try the noodles first. I want to try this um, black bean noodle. I do like black bean noodles. When I noticed um, that it was different when I got home. Let me zoom in a little bit. I noticed it was different than the one that I had purchased the first time I had black bean noodles here at home because mine was in a powder form, the black bean sauce, and this one was actually in a liquid form, like like a saucy form. So I didn't, I didn't add the eggs because I have two cheese pastries, I have a dessert pastry here and another dessert pastry here that I also wanna try. So let's see, it's so hot and steamy. It just came off the stove and I also left the griddle on warm so that I can heat up my bread. It's nice and the bread is nice and warm. Actually, the, the top is still cool, but ooh, the bottom is warm, super warm. Maybe I just flip it over just for a few seconds there just to get that cheese warmed up. I don't even know if you're supposed to eat it warmed up, but I'm assuming because it has um, dogs in there, so hot dogs. <laughs> Let's see. If okay it's a good flavor it's maybe a little bit sweeter than i remembered on the other black bean noodles that i had definitely gonna need my coldest water for this one I, i'm assuming because i know it's gonna be hot don't forget to use code lizlo at checkout for free shipping and they also engrave your bottles <clears throat> for an additional charge okay let's try this spicy one this one's hot too in temperature oh my gosh i'm a little bit scared to see what it's if it's like the spiciness gonna overpower the black bean noodle taste or what's gonna happen here let's flip these over now they're warm enough now Ooh, i can smell a jalapeno <clears throat> that is spicy this is as spicy as the one time <clears throat> spicy noodles Whew. maybe if I mix the two because I cannot distinguish the black bean taste on this one
<clears throat> it's like an initial <clears throat> hint of that sweetness in the beginning, but it is so spicy. Not as spicy as the two times, the two times spicy noodles. Whoa. They did the most with that. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this one brings down the heat on the spicy one. Okay, let's try. I'm kind of scared to try the actual beans because I don't want to get grossed out. I don't know. I just, I'm probably going to eat it within the, the noodle mix. That like that, I will eat it. Like I picked up, I picked them up already. Let's see. I just, I don't know. I feel I am very like textured kind of person, so I feel like I will get grossed out trying it alone. Let's get this bite. There's some black bean, a, a whole black bean noodle in there. Oh, it's like a meaty texture. Unless there's something else in there. Hello? <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> it tastes good. Okay. Let me try the jalapeno. I should have flipped it on this side. The spicy on this side and the regular on this side. But it's okay. Let's try this jalapeno one here. It's literally just like a croissant. Croissant, however you want to say it. Croissant. With hot dog cheese and jalapeno that's what it looks like i don't think it is a croissant i'm not quite sure but let's give it a try croissant to me maybe like one of those croissants that you get at the donut shop that are stuffed with cheese and ham something like that maybe it's good I'm not too fond of the hot dog mm. I'm try with the bite of this It's good. I think this one is going to... Oh, my friend's calling me. Never mind. I was going to show his call ID, but it has his whole name. I'll call you back. Um, I feel like this one's going to taste the same, except minus the jalapeno. This one has cheese and hot dog. And, like, seasoning. Okay, I'm gonna be real. I don't like the hot dogs in there. I'm very picky with my hot dogs. And these are not it. Literally, my hot dogs have to be like, not burnt, but they have to be really, really fried. And these are not the way I like my hot dogs. So, unfortunately, I will be omitting the dogs and just eating the croissant, the bread, because the bread is really good. It's so soft. Let's try with this one here. Not a big fan of how this one tastes. This is just a, it was just the cheese and hot dog one. I don't know what it is about this one that I'm not too fond of, but this one minus the hot dog. I can dig it. Let's try one more bite <clears throat> with the hot dog and then I'll be taking that off.
Mm -hmm. That one definitely tastes better than this one. Okay. I need to make room for the dessert because there's a lot of food. And that fruit pastry looks really good. This this one is spicy, really spicy. This one's more on the sweet side. I'm move this a little bit here. Oh no wonder it's on something here. aligned okay whatever this one's super spicy but I think I don't know maybe we make a little hybrid together with the two well might have had to been done initially because of the flavors already settled into the noodle but maybe if they were Mixed together, it would probably be a, a nice concoction there. Let's try it. Yeah. Sorry about the noise. Okay. Together is very tolerable. I'm going to get another piece of this here, and then I'm going to try the sweets. I wasn't a very, a very big fan of the cheese and dog pastry, um, pastries, I guess you would call them, right? Um, but, or buns, whatever, but they were all right. I mean, it was worth a try. But I want to try the sweet stuff here. I'm going to open this one up. This one has... Oh, this is Puff Pasta Taro Bun. I don't care for the... I think they're almonds. I'm not sure. Looks like almonds. I'm not sure. I'm not I'm not too fond of the almond look. I was the topping, but... Excuse me. I was intrigued because it said it was taro. So, look how flaky that is. Ooh, okay. So I kind of just want to break into this to see if there's anything in the middle. Oh, there is something in the middle. You see that? Let's give that a try, you guys. Forgive the background noises. Um. Oh, my nose is getting watery because of the hot noodle. It is very, very nice and soft and flaky. I didn't get much of the taro though, so I didn't get a really like an idea of what it tastes like. Look at that taro. Let's try it again. It's a little plain Jane, too plain Jane for me. Let's get into this one right here. I do like taro, like, um, I like, um, taro boba, ooh, so good, and I have tried taro froyo, it's good, okay, this is ridiculous, 
I don't want to ruin the top of it though. So, wow, they really did a whole number here to secure the bag. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Put it on this side. I didn't want to get all that good stuff on there. Let's see. Look how beautiful that is, though. It has strawberry, kiwi. It has a big old grape on there. Looks like a slice of peach or something, and some cream and the croissant. Let's let's bite into this one, shall we? Let's see. Mm. Mm -hmm. I have a feeling this one was going to be the best one. Mm. Mm -hmm. Wow. The reason why I'm biting into this one is because I got both my parents each their own. And then... I'm gonna let them try these here. I don't know if they'll like them. Maybe they will. Who knows? But this is definitely not gonna. I'm not gonna let them try the spicy noodles because they're too spicy for them. But I'm just gonna take one more bite of this one. And. So overall, this was a really cool experience because I had really never been very open with trying new things because of how I am so picky with like the texture in my food and stuff like that, you know? So, sorry, I had to pause y'all because I am not trying to get copyright, but I'm going to let y'all go now because the music playing and the everything playing in the background, I do not want to get copyright. So, um... Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Make sure that you guys check your local Asian market out to see if they have any of these good stuff. If you haven't tried the black bean noodles, I do recommend them. I do recommend like my sister does. Um, she fries a egg on there. I do uh, over medium because I like the yolk and then breaks the yolk on top of the noodles. It tastes really, really good. These black bean noodles are not as tasty as the ones that I did in my previous video. My black bean um, noodle video check that out it's on my channel these pastries they were okay I don't think I would buy those again the taro was very plain I don't think I would be buying that again but this one here was my favorite and uh, if I go again if I see this I will be buying that again so thank you guys so much for tuning in I know I didn't really make a di big dent in my plate but I feel like really full because of the pastries so, I mean, it's all carbs, literally. It's I'm just having a bunch of carbs here. But thank you guys so much for tuning in. I love y'all, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!